Hey guys, I'm Denny Chapman and welcome to The Gun Show. We've got a really fun episode lined up for you today featuring the Tactical Edge Grunt Rifle and a portion of my interview with Kentucky Ballistics from SHOT Show 2022. Hey guys, before we forget, I want to remind everybody to go to bignewsbdu.com. That's bignewsbdu.com. You're going to enter to win a BDU exclusive Vertex Gamut Overland Camo Bag. It's worth over 200 bucks, and we want all of our viewers, whether you're a member or not, to have a chance to win it. That's bignewsbdu.com. Also, a reminder of the huge Hot Deals sale. Once you log into your BDU member account, Click on deals and you're going to find dozens of items priced at 10, 15, even 25% under our cost. And remember guys, you can always go back and watch this entire episode after the fact on our YouTube channel, The Gun Show. And of course, we're also cross-posting on John Martin Talks and all the other BDU social media platforms, including the new excluded.com that's spelled without the E, X-C-L-U-D-E-D.com. Make sure you check it out and subscribe there as well. And please remember to engage. When you see me do this, uh, I'm hitting those buttons too. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. By doing that, we're all helping to set a positive 2A algorithm on social media. All right, here we go. We're gonna roll a portion of my interview with Scott from Kentucky Ballistics at SHOT Show 2022. Check this out. Hey, SHOT Show 2022, we got Scott, Kentucky Ballistics with us here. You know, I know most everybody has heard the story. The story, yeah. Tell me the story. Tell me the story, Scott. Well, I, you'll be here all shot show. I'm gonna tell you the whole story. So <laughs> let me give you like the, the quick little notes. So yeah, uh, April 9th, 50 cal uh, exploded, uh, detonated on me. A uh, piece of shrapnel went through my throat, se uh, not severed, lacerated my jugular, uh, punctured a hole in my right lung. Uh, let's see, broke my face in a bunch of spots. Uh, I was already ugly before, so now I'm way worse off. <laughs> Snap this finger. Um, I lost all my blood. Like they said, you hold like eight units. They gave me five. The only thing that uh, saved me was my thumb. I shoved my thumb into my throat. Literally inside yeah, your I took, body I took my, uh, my shirt and used it as like uh, packing and then crammed it in, tucked my chin, and then we were gone. And then uh, once we got to the hospital, you know, they found out my right lung. Were collapsed. you by yourself? No, I had my dad with me. And if he wasn't with me, I'd probably be it because. Wow. Uh, in a situation like that, you it's really nice to have a battle buddy with you, you know, oh, to go, hey, you're bleeding out of your neck. You, you know, <laughs> we should do something about that. So, uh, yeah, man, we got to the hospital, uh, put a chest tube in while I was awake. That's awesome. You know, big metal rod, and then you shove it through your rib cage. Holy. Uh, and then uh, from there, yeah, flew me out to Vanderbilt and started operating on me. They cut me, uh, cut my whole rib cage open and my collarbone because my jugular was cut behind my collarbone. I always enjoy talking to Scott, and we'll post the entire interview real soon on the Gun Show YouTube channel so that you can catch the whole conversation. It was a good one, too, guys. Now we're going to take a closer look at this Tactical Edge Grunt Rifle right after our safety segment. You know what this is. This is my gang sign. It's the four cardinal rules of gun safety. Here we go. Let's talk about it. Rule number one, treat all guns as if they're loaded at all times. Times. Very important and common sense. Number two, never point your gun at anything you're not willing to destroy. Doesn't matter what situation you're in, that is very important as well. Number three is your finger. That's your best safety. Always keep your finger away from the trigger until you're ready to fire. And don't ever depend on a mechanical safety. Depend on yourself, guys. And number four, always know your target, what's in front, beside, behind, and around that target. The four cardinal rules of gun safety. Remember them, guys, so that when you go out and enjoy your Second Amendment rights, you are going to be a safe and responsible gun owner. All right, guys, let's take a closer look at this awesome rifle. First off, this is not your run-of-the-mill base AR-15. This is the Tactical Edge Grunt. It is a direct result of real-time feedback from the company's engineers combined with testing and evaluation by active duty Special Forces operators, ending up as one of the lightest and most durable 5.56 carbines on the market today. They basically made this rifle durable enough to be blown up, thrown out of a window, uh, or drug behind a vehicle and still function. So let's go over some of the features front to back. You know how I like to do it. First off, guys, this is a very high quality, duty ready AR style rifle. It's got a 14 and a half inch barrel with 
a pinned and welded flash hider to make the overall length 16 inches so it's not an SBR. You're not required to file any additional paperwork to own this rifle. Uh, here we've got a 13 and a half inch WRS M-Lock handguard ready for accessories. I love M-Lock. M-Lock is these elongated slots here. You've also got the slots on the bottom. On the other side, M-Lock allows you to mount an infinite possibility of accessories. What would you mount on the side or under? Uh, lights, optics, um, additional stabilizing devices, a laser and an aiming device of some uh, of your choice. Very easy to mount up with this M-Lock. We've also got this full length Picatinny rail that's ready for your choice of optics. And one thing I really appreciate about this rifle is I look at these rifles very closely and I try to see if I can find the seam where the uh, handguard uh, pick rail uh, sort of blends in with the upper receiver pick rail. And this is a very nice, very tight blend. Uh, moving on to the receivers, the upper and lower receivers are 7075 T6 aircraft grade aluminum upper and lower receivers. And one thing you should know about uh, the T7075 uh, T6 aluminum is that it's very tough. It's extremely durable. It makes it lightweight, uh, but, but, very, but very, very tough and durable. We have upgraded furniture here as well. Let me uh, tell you what that means, by the way. Furniture, we're not talking about chairs and couches and kitchen tables, guys. Furniture refers to the buttstock, the grip, the hand guards, uh, the, uh, uh, the additional things that are necessary to manipulate this rifle that can be changed. So what we've got here is an upgraded Magpul MOA K2 pistol grip. Now what's that, what that does is, you see this little cutout area right here? This allows you to get your hand even a little higher and uptight and gives you that much more gripping stability. You've even got some storage here in the bottom. And I really like this Magpul SLK adjustable buttstock. Now, you see how it takes a little bit of effort to slide this? Have you ever gone into your local gun store and picked up an AR-15 off the shelf that has an adjustable buttstock and you've adjusted it and notice it's got some wiggle and it, it makes a little noise? This does not. This is a very good, tight fit and I love this Magpul uh, adjustable stock. By the way, let's do some gun safety again since I'm handling this rifle. We're gonna lock the bolt back and we're gonna show you visually and physically that we are safe here. Uh, no magazine, empty chamber. I'm using my eyes and my finger. Magazine is out, chamber is empty. You can never be safe enough, always check twice. Now this has an enhanced mil spec trigger designed for combat shooting. It comes with a proper mil spec bolt carrier group that's nitride finish for durability and corrosion resistance. I've owned a lot of firearms with a nitride finish and I can tell you they are extremely corrosion resistant. I love anything that's nitride. The nitride process basically bakes the nitrides into the pores of the metal and um, gives it an extremely tough finish. And that's uh, very, very important, especially with the rifles like this that are designed for combat. ARs, generally speaking, are very simple. If you've never owned an AR-15, you are missing out. They're easy to operate. They're easy to maintain. They're easy to field strip. You just knock out this rear pin uh, here. It will hinge forward. You're able to remove your charging handle. By the way, this charging handle is extended. So this is upgraded furniture here with this charging handle. And you can see how easy it is to manipulate. If it's locked back, it takes very little effort to uh, charge forward and it does have a mil spec bolt carrier group. And what's that mean? It means the BCG, the bolt carrier group, is designed to handle uh, full auto. This is a semi-auto rifle. This is not a machine gun. It's not full auto, but you have that tougher, more durable um, bolt carrier group as well. So guys, just a really nice example of a combat ready AR style rifle that we're proud to show you it's available to you as a BDU member. And if you're not a member, you can join today for 99 cents. You can't buy much for a cup of coffee these days. Uh, can't even buy a cup of coffee for a buck, but for 99 cents, you can have a 30 day trial membership with full member benefits, access to not only these great items but over 300,000 other second amendment related items, guns, ammo, optics, holsters, accessories, survival gear, and lots of other cool second amendment related stuff. And you'll have access to our customer service reps, live people who take a lot of pride in their job right here in our Gainesville, Florida headquarters. I get to see them every day. 
Uh, they're ready to take your calls. They're taking calls right now. They're answering questions with their expert knowledge, and they're ready to give you that VIP customer service that you deserve and that we're so proud of. Also, as a member, you'll also have additional benefits like 2A insurance, your own digital gun vault, and exclusive BDU member content like the exclusive BDU member webinar we just hosted with Jared from Guns and Gadgets. You'll also be able to check that out real soon. Uh, it'll be posted at uh, the Gun Show YouTube channel as well. The Tactical Edge Grunt, check it out on the BDU website. Don't forget to enter our contest at bignewsbdu.com. I'm checking my time. I'm officially out of time, uh, folks. Uh, have a great day, everybody. We'll see you again soon on The Gun Show.